Our faith um, is very important to our family. Family is very important to us as well. Things just don't happen for, you know, just by chance. It's definitely a reason. You could call it divine intervention. Well, my husband and my son went to the junkyard to find some parts for his truck. My son said, hey, Dad, look what I found. And it was a Bible. I didn't know what he found. I thought he was looking for, you know, the part that we got. He found this Bible laying on the floor of a van. And the guy went, that's between you and God. I'm not going to charge you for a Bible. If you found it, it's meant to be, so uh, y'all can have that Bible. Two years later, I started cleaning out his room this summer and came across it. Tattered edges, delicate pages, some ripped, others folded at the corner. So I started going through the Bible and, and looking for any way, like, where, wonder where this came from, like, you know, who this belongs to, and that's when I came upon the name. In between two pages stuck together, Gay S. Kelly, written in cursive. That's it, that's all. As she flipped through, it was printed in Great Britain, and that's typically, you don't find that. It was a Bible like Gina Greer had never seen before. It just says, to the King of Great Britain, France and Ireland, defender of the faith. And it just goes on and talks about um, this book, blessings to those that read this book. The quest now is to return it to the hands it came from. The stories it tells, the history that holds behind it. The Lord your God is, is mighty to say, great to you with you will love. rejoice over you. I know if this is someone's mother and maybe they, she's passed away, um, this would be a great gift to give to that family. And a reward for the Greers to be a part of yet another story in the Bible's journey. That's just divine right there. In Simpsonville, Kylie Jones, WYFF News 4.